Good morning, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my morning news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Memorial Day weekend is right around the corner, and it will look different for many this year. Of course, the beaches are still closed due to COVID-19 pandemic, and this year's Memorial Day will look very different for sure. Because usually on Memorial Day weekend, lots of people go to the beaches. Sununu tells Granite Staters to continue social distancing over Memorial Day weekend. Governor says he doesn't see need for heavy-handed enforcement. Governor Chris Sununu is urging Granite Staters to adhere to social distancing guidelines as Memorial Day weekend approaches. In downtown Concord, some restaurants that don't have outdoor seating are working to add it, and more people were getting out and about Thursday in the warm, sunny weather. The level of activity could be a preview of the typically busy Memorial Day weekend. Sununu said he knows some Granite Staters are very eager to try to get back to some sense of normalcy in the COVID-19 pandemic. We just want to keep encouraging people to keep that physical distance. Be careful of social gatherings in groups of more than 10 and enjoy the weekend for everything it has to offer, Sununu said. The governor said the state will be keeping an eye on places where crowds often gather on Memorial Day weekend in an attempt to make sure closures and other restrictions are not violated. He said the effort won't look any different than the kind of light touch enforcement the state has been using over the past couple months. Whether it's working with state police or local law enforcement and the local communities. I think everyone's had a very good approach so far, he said. I think there's been very few incidents where we've had to come down with that heavy hand. Sununu said he expects to deliver news Friday about a plan for the eventual reopening of state beaches. We're still kind of working out the guidelines and the timing of what might be possibly making sure all of the local and town issues are being addressed in some way in making sure we have a comprehensive plan to move forward, he said. Sununu said that if and when the state beaches reopen, he doesn't anticipate using additional staff to enforce social distancing, but with parking restrictions, it's possible it will be more difficult for the unusual mass of crowds to materialize. And that does it for my morning news report right here on the Riley King Network. I hope you all have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you back here later on today for another news report. Goodbye, everyone.